Oh, yes. That's right. Core 2020 has arrived, and uh, this is the second one of these 90 uh, booster pack bundles I have uh, purchased here. We got a Rin and Siri inseparable, so that's what happens if you purchase the 90 for the 18,000 gems, all that stuff. Really cool, but let's get to cracking. Open our packs. Let's see what all we get. Um, where are we at here? Let's see. Whoops, we just go to packs. We probably have quite a few. I've noticed some lag. Oh, wow, 235. Are you guys ready? Now, the first few, I just want to take my time and crack them individually. Not a whole lot, but then we'll speed it up and start doing 10 at a time. But this is really cool. The latest set for sure. Ooh, Baron Talarian Archmage. Cool card. I'm um, looking forward to seeing what it's able to do. Um, and if the battlefield return up to one target creature, plains of Arcs, turn his hand. It's legit, man. At the beginning of your end step, if a permanent was put into your hand from the battlefield, this turn, draw a card. It's almost like a little Tafiri. In a sense. In a sense. I know. How did I already get a common wild card? Oh, she's so silly. Okay. Tormod's pack leader. All right. We got some, uh, some for them doggies and tribal dogs. That's cool. You guys pumped? Are you pumped? I mean, it is here. It has arrived. Idol of Endurance. There you go. All right. We're going to zip through these ones. Um, I'll do 10 like this, and then we'll start doing 10 at a time uh, just to see what all we can pull. That's, like, really what it's about. I want to see how many Mythics we're going to open out of all this, um, how many Mythic wild cards we could possibly get, you know, uh, stuff like that. This is going to be a fun one as well. I'm going to start making decks, I'd say, in a few days. Right now, the channel is on overload with um, new box opening content um, in paper, so... Glad to see this glorious anthem in here. That's really legit. All right, we're about to get to uh, 10 at a time here. But I wanted to slow roll the first ones and just chit-chat with you guys. Sanctum of All Shrine decks are going to be fun. Maybe. I don't think they're going to be competitive, but you never know. You could do some fun things with it. And then we have Mr. Stormwing Entity. Legit, legit. All right, just two more packs to crack here. Or three more, and then we're done. All right. Ooh, Maze Mind Tome. This could be fun. This could be fun. This could be fun. All right. What's the most packs you guys ever opened at once? What's the most ever? We got Transmorgrify. Transmorgrify. That's legit. All right. Let's get to opening 10 at a time here. Are we ready? Oh, the big ones. How many Mythics can we get? No Mythics yet, right? Whoa. No mythics at all in here. Holy smokes, man. Love this card, but where are the mythics? What? This almost makes me not want to open more. If we don't get any mythics in this next one, something's wrong. Let's see what happens here. Okay. Okay, there's a mythic wild card. What? Watsy, where are all the mythics? What is going on? Uh, okay. A mythic wild card. We didn't even get a mythic. We got a mythic wild card. Um, cool, we got this. We got two of these Solemns and uh, Basseries. Got my glorious second one of those. Spark Hunter. All right, we better see some mythics here. Okay, whoa. It's like they threw them all in a row right there. That's scary stuff. So we got, and okay, I feel better. Got Garrick in this one, along with Grim Tutor and an Oog in the Spirit Dragon. Now that, my friends, is a pretty solid opening. Uh, pretty good 10 packs. Um, the last one we just opened up, we had a Necro uh, Mentia and uh, Animal Sanctuary. It's like a lot of these cards, we already, I feel we already opened. I know we're opening quite a few at a time, but it's weird. All right, let's see what else we get in the next 10. Ooh, no Mythics. That's weird. They bundled them all together right there. Uh, I almost feel maybe if I open one at a time. Maybe. No, let's not do that again. All right, let's do 10 more. And I'll go one at a time. Another thing, the server's been crazy. Okay, there's one Mythic wildcard. What is going on? Th this is strange. Very, very peculiar, to say the least. Like, they're really cutting back on the amount of Mythics you get, and they're just flooding you with rares this time around. We opened a lot of packs, it seems, and we should have more. What's that, four Mythics? Five, like, not including the Wildcard Mythics? No Mythics whatsoever here. 
All right, something's wrong. You guys, have, has anyone experienced this? I want to hear feedback. What did you open out of these Core 2021 packs? And where's all the freaking Mythics? This is terrible. I don't care for Mythic wildcards. Show me the Mythics. Show me the Mythics. Something's not right. Maybe we got to, like, do it one at a time. Let's try one at a time, see if we can get some Mythics this way. Maybe mix up the algorithm or whatever's going on. Great card, but still, where are the Mythics? Okay. I'll be blown away if um, I, I'm, we're going to find out. We'll, we'll take a look at all the cards afterwards and see how many mythics we actually got. Okay, let's salvo. Oh, wow. Guys, this is not looking too hot right now. We pulled a total of three mythics out of all this so far. And it seems like the cards that are really good, you get less of. You ever notice that when you're opening these packs? <clears throat> let's see what happens. Okay, there's one. So, what do we start with? Like 230, 240? So we opened like 70 or 80 packs, whatever it is, and opened four Mythics. I might be mistaken by one or two, maybe five, not including Mythic wild cards. Come on, man. <laughs> Booster box usually get like four to six on average in 36 packs. This is not good. <laughs> Um, and this is coming from a guy who opens booster boxes like it's going out of style. Okay, that one felt a little better. Why? Just get, where's the. I like the. Hey, I can't complain about Mythic Wild Cards because you can make that into anything. So that's not a complaint, you know. I will say that. It's not a complaint. Um, I'm really interested how many, uh, how many at the end of this we will actually have. This is going to be a fun card. Mangara the Diplomat. <clears throat> okay, there we go. We got one. They all seem to be centered when you open one. Like I don't see a Mythic down here. That's different. Before, like they would just be putting them anywhere. But here's the new Lily. This is going to be fun to play with. Discards a card each opponent who uh, can't lose his three life. That's legit. This is great for like a discard, man. Uh, discard deck. I'll be for sure put one together. It's like not enough hours in a day basically to do all this. Another scavenger news. Uh, Lost but seeking. That's amazing. Play two additional lands on each of your turns. That's really sweet. And we're down. It's gonna be a lot of fun too. Heroic. There's so many cool cards in this set. I'm just really looking forward to playing with all them and building decks. If you have any ideas, any deck ideas you want me to do or try out, um. By all means, let me know in the comments, you know, some card synergies you'd like to see, some explosiveness, some stupid busted combos that you're aware of. Share it, man. I'll, I'll see what I can do. Elder Gar Gargareth. Gar Gar Gargareth. Beast mode. All right, all right. It's hard to say how many mythic wild cards we got. We're at 12 right now. I think I started with maybe two when I first started doing this. Oh, we got this guy, too. Okay. Um, for those of you who haven't seen this before, I guess we can just crack this really quick. This is uh, the treasure chest, basically. So we get an additional mythic, two rares, and uncommon times three. And then we got to go back into packs, Jack. All right. 100 more to go. Wow. Okay. Ooh. Okay. Now the mythics are showing up a little bit, a little bit. Uh, no, notice... Um, no uh, Tefiri, but I did order in advance, and we did get uh, the two Tefiris, which is pretty cool, and the Mastery Pass thing, so. Ooh, okay, I think we almost have a place at a basery over here. That's like three, I think. We're up to three on that. And this is one of the, it's going to be one of the lesser played mythics, in my opinion. Um, maybe not, though. With all the creature protection right now, maybe not. I mean, Celestia creature... It could be where it's at, man. Uh, we'll see. Whoops, I accidentally clicked on one pack. That's going to make it a little slower here. Sorry about that. Something else I noticed about this, they don't have a way, once you get down um, to like nine packs and under, like if you did that route, you didn't hit the 10 every time, made a mistake like I just did, there's no way to open all you know nine of those packs at once. You have to do it one at a time, which is something I hope they fix at some point. Elder Gargareth, that's cool. Another one of those. So no matter how we do this, we're going to have to 
open them uh, one at a time till we get to 10 again. Cool. Fiery Emancipation. A legit sauce. That's legit. Very, very powerful card. This would be fun to run in a Brawl build. Yeah. Uh, that'd be great for Brawl. That would be a lot of fun for Brawl. All right. Animal Sanctuary. All right. Just a few more packs so we can get back to doing 10s. We got Ooh, Sublime Epiphany. Okay. All Carmine. Hot Dogs. Another Sublime Epiphany. Rigged. Can we say it's rigged? All right. If that was another Sublime, I'd be like, all right, that's it. I'm done. I'm out of here. I'm heading out. Okay. Yeah, definitely check out the box openings, guys, on the channel. A lot of fun. Heck ton of fun. All right. Animal Sanctuary. All right, let's go to 10 more. Boom. And then we'll take a look at all the cards we pulled from here. Two more mythic wild cards. That is so strange, though, that they're like they're giving us wild cards, but they're not giving us the actual cards. There's another Garrick. Okay, Chromatic Ori, finally. That's cool. Took forever to pull that thing. Man, talk about rampage. Whoa, baby. All right. We got the Vito again. Hooded Blightfang, sure. And uh, Double Vision's a neat card. All right, down to the nitty-gritty. Ooh, finally. I almost forgot about him. Terror of the Peaks finally shows up. 200 cards or 200 packs opened. Wow. Uh, that's a lot. Yeah, 200. Uh, yeah, it took him a while to show up. And we got Grim Tutor on that, too. Just noticed that. So we got two Grim Tutors now. Not bad at all. This little Flash guy. All right. Ten more. Let's see how we did. Another one mythic there. Okay. Show me the goods, baby. Ooh. I don't recall seeing too many of her. Okay. Another double vision. No mythics yet again, but we did get Incinerator. Another one of those. I think I have play sets of that. All right. We are down to the nitty gritty, and then we'll take a really quick look at how much of the set we got. Wow, only 230 cards in. We finally pulled Auto Fury. Now, I should have play sets of this guy, this chick. Uh, probably Scavenger Goose. I should have play sets of a lot of this stuff. These cats, I mean, everything, really. Took you a while to come around there, Tafiri. Thanks for showing up. And another Lily. And, of course, the finished play set of Bassery over here. Um, wow. And the lands just flooded out really quick. That's insane. They need to do a better job shuffling this stuff, man. It almost doesn't make sense. Like, they're making you use your wild cards on, on, on stuff they know you're going to want to play. I don't. I just don't get it. Um, but there you have it. Okay, let's take a look now at all of our goodies here. Collection. So here's everything new that we got. Let's just go this route. We're going to go Mythic and Rare we care about a lot so rare mythic and we'll show the not collected as well in here for core uh, core set 2021 okay let's take a look so we got one bane slayer and one manjara that's not good play set of bassery of course basery sure whoops my camera's a little off sorry just now noticing that. That's terrible. That's terrible. All right. So we got that. That is something. Um, got two Tefiris. I thought I got the sleeves for this. Weird. I thought they gave me two, and I maybe not. Maybe just got one. Two Grim Tutors. Okay. Play sets of uh, all this stuff over here. All the rares, basically. We got play sets and play sets of. And then, yeah, more play sets here. Double vision. Wow. Play set, play set, play set, play set. Right? Play sets, yes. I want to say yes. Really, really neat. Liliana, we got three of her, which is pretty good. Good feels, good feels. Uh, two Garricks. One Terror of the Peaks. Everyone wants to play this card. See what I'm saying? Like, really? Antifiri, like, come on. It's always like that too. That's like that's not right. It should be completely random. They shouldn't. 
they shouldn't do you like that. Because they know people are going to want, they're going to spend their mythics on that stuff, you know. And then you give me a play for the base three. Come on, man. Get out of here. Wizards in your crap. Um, yeah, I got these um, for the purchasing the bundles the way I did. So we got a play set of those, which is nice, which is very nice. Uh, the lands. Again, lands are one of the most important things in Magic. If you're playing on Arena, it's all about the lands, man. Um, if you don't have a good land base, your deck is going to be garbage. Hate to say that. Unless you're running mono, you still need some kind of supporting lands, like those castles or something, usually, if you're running a, a single color. But lands, dual lands, are the, like, w the backbone of any deck. You know, for it to work smooth, you need good lands. Believe me, okay? So the fact that this is how our lands look, I, I'm very disgusted right now in Wizards. This has been going on since beta. I've been playing this when it was closed to the public, all right? That's how long I've been playing Arena, when it was in testing phase. And the same exact problem existed then that exists today, and that is they don't hook you up with the better cards. They just give you the stuff you don't need. I'm not saying this is a bad card, okay? I'm sure it has its place, but there's certain cards... They just give, like, why would I get play sets of almost every single rare except for my lands? Think about that. <laughs> Not good. That shows some shadiness going on because people are going to want the dual lands. All right. And then we got one Ugin. Come on. We're all going to want Ugin. One Chromatic. Got play sets of every other card. Th that is rigged. That's just evidence, man. That goes to show you. And then here's all the other cards you can get. We didn't pull a single Massacre Worm in all those packs. Get out of here. Um, that's nutty. Unbelievable. No discontinuity. Dis, uh, discontinuity. And what else? Not one single Temple of Mystery. Shut up. That's stupid. That is stupid. Um, yeah, there you have it. And no Chandra either. Not one fabled passage and all that. Stupid. Maybe because I already... But you know what? Maybe they did that. Maybe because I already have all these uh, in non-core 2021. Maybe that's why they gave these to me last. I think that makes sense now. <laughs> I'm going to take that back because I already have these from a previous set. So why would they give me more? You know what I'm saying? They, and they did save them for the end. Maybe that's how they're doing it. That's actually not bad. I think that that kind of worked out pretty good, if that is the case. But as far as some of these really good mythics, I'm a little disappointed in that. Yeah, because I have all these uh, lands already in a uh, different set. Uh, yeah, sure do. Okay. Well, that's cool. Anyway, foot and mouth on that one at the end. So that's something they did a little different. Um, but let me hear your experience. One fiery emancipation. They really should have given us more mythics. Uh, wild cards total of 22 mythic rares. We got a few uncommon cards there. 278 rares. I mean, that's not what I got just right now. But the mythics, I think we opened about... We got between 18 and 20 mythic wild cards out of that. That's not too bad. Plus, we had the vault thing we opened, too. Don't forget about that. All right. Um, yeah, let me know your guys' thoughts and opinions. What deck you're looking forward to playing. I like hearing back from you guys. And uh, yeah, skidding, skidding, skidding. Uh.